I thank you all for felicitating M <laughs> for this walk, for this walk of hope. Now, many of us of the dignitaries mentioned that I walked 7,500 kilometers, 16 months, so on and so on, which is true in a way, yes. But I want to remind you, I have said this many times before, that when we started this walk from Kanyakumari, you know, Kanyakumari is called zero point. There is no land after that. For us, the land mass ends and the sea begins. So that's called by the highways department, zero point. I said to all our friends who walked with us, consider yourself as absolute zero and start this walk. Believe me, we did not know how we are going to walk. Well, I have some good friends here. I don't want to name them again, they run into many numbers. At least seven, eight of them who formed the core committee which worked so very hard to make this yatra a success. I mean, there are others also, but these people worked day and night for two years before we started this yatra. So why I am saying this? I walked, but the effort was not only mine, but it was done by all people, including those who are sitting in front of me, who contributed in many ways for the walk. I'm not talking about financial contributions. Actually, when we started the walk at Kanyakumari, we had a small budget of about 20, 22 lakhs. And some people told me, you must be out of your mind. They said, you're mad. How can you walk till Kashmir with this budget? It's not possible. But we walked. And as we walked, help came and we kept walking. I personally think that this is a fulfillment of the prophecy given by Maheshwanath Babaji, my dear Guru. <laughs> many years ago, while sitting as a young man, while I was sitting, while we were sitting in Uttar Kashi looking at the Ganga, said, Ek din Kanyakumari se Kashmir tak chalna padega. I got frightened. I said, Babaji, kyun? why should I walk from Kanyakumari to Kashmir? I am happy to walk with you in the Himalayas. Wherever you go, I'll go. I'll wash the clothes. I'll look after you. I'll do what you want, but I can't walk like this. And his next words were a bombshell. Because I, as many of you know, I'm generally of a retiring temperament. I like Ekant. He said, I said, Babaji, no. I said, this is the line you should draw, we can't. Then he asked me, when, some, when you first came here, one day I asked you, what do you think of yourself in relation to me? What do you think of I said, Babaji, I said, yes. And then what did you say? I said, I said, I consider me as myself as your dog, your puppy. You know, I was only 21 years old. I didn't know the importance of what I was saying. So Babaji said, you said that? I said, yes. And then Babaji said, what did I reply? So he said, you said, Kutte to ho sakte ho, mag dum ziyada mat hilana. Then you may be a dog, but don't shake your tail too much. Did you say that? Did I say that? I said, ah, Baba. Then he said, don't shake your tail, do as I told you. And for years it didn't happen and now it happened. So, when people say he did this, he walked, I know they're saying out of love and affection, but I think it's Babaji who walked. Otherwise, I don't think I could have done it. Impossible. It's not possible. When I think of it now, I don't know how we reached Srinagar. 
and everywhere there are warnings. Oh, people will attack. There are people who don't want communal harmony. In some states, the governments were so scared that their commandos walking along. I begged them saying, why are these gunmen walking when we are walking for peace? But they said, no, it's our responsibility. And so, the walk went on. I don't want, I'm not going to talk too much. As I said earlier, my walk is my talk. Mm -hmm. There was a leader who did some terrible things also. But one of the good things she said was, Kam ziyada baate kam. So, this was the walk. And it took us to so many states, 11 states, 16 months, 500 days almost. Everywhere I went, till Karnataka, till Kerala, I escaped with Malayalam. In Tamil Nadu, I did Tamil. In Karnataka, I get, got into the problem of not being able to speak in Kannada. So I started talking in Hindi, because in rural areas, people said Hindi me boli. And it went on and on, and now I have to brush up my English a bit. <laughs> because it went on, carried on till Srinagar. I used to start at walk by saying, Namaskar, hum is Bharat jaisa kahi rashtra kahi nahi hai sansar mein, and go on. So, actually what I want to tell you is this, the essence. There is no country in the world which has 26 languages. 150 dialects, so many religions, and among them so many sampradayas. And yet, generally, this is the impression I got. I met more than, we met more than 20 lakhs of people, maybe 15 lakhs. We still think that we are one. So that, that is the uniqueness of this country that with so many streams flowing into the ocean of Manavekta. See, we are one. But there are fissures here and there. And things break when you feel sad. When your heart breaks, when you see people saying, I belong to this religion, you belong to this, so we are different. So this was a walk, not so much a cure, but a prevention. It was a preventive walk. We said, let's find an inoculation by which at least the future generations are safe. And it's the youth who are responsible for the unity and integrity and oneness of this country. It's the youth. We might have committed mistakes. Our hair is grey. Believe me, my hair is grey, but I'm not old. Please. <laughs> and if you think that the walk has ended, like Justice Venticelli said, we have to restart the Rasagullas again. <laughs> and when I was sitting here, Mr. Kamat was talking to me and he said, so what are you going to do about the follow-up? Before the walk, I went to see Mr. Hamid Ansari, the Vice President. He asked me the same thing before the walk started. He said, after the walk, what will you do to follow it up? So believe me, friends, the walk has not ended. The walk has just begun. Apart from the fact that another one and a half, two years, I would probably make a walk. We will probably walk from uh, into the northeast. Before the walk, we went to meet Dr. Kalam, a wonderful man. I have witnesses who came with me. Balaji was there with me. And he said, you have left out the Northeast. I said, sir, yes. Because I told him, already this walk is going to take us 16 months. If we go to the Northeast and if the walk becomes longer, probably I might get a divorce notice from my wife. <laughs> well, I didn't say that. <laughs> and, but now, this walk is over. The next walk will certainly begin. This was from K to K, Kanyakumari to Kashmir. 
And I'm convinced that it did have some effect. At least we have sown the seeds of harmony. Now, the seeds that have been sown have to be nurtured. And that nurturing is not in my hands, it's in your hands. So we wish to meet you all at some point and discuss how to further this. I'm not interested in saying that the Manavekta mission or Satsang Foundation is doing it. Not required. See, the idea is, between people who are doing good work, there should be no competition. If there is a competition like that, then nothing works, it's just a competition. Now, Akshara Foundation is doing work. Why can't we join them and help them out? Why should we say that this has to be done only by us? This is also division. So I'm saying, that let's put our heads together, all of you. You may be having your own little ways of working this out and see how to bring about a change to follow up this walk. And the next walk would probably be if all our coordinators and they're all smiling, many of them, they know how hard they worked. Balaji is hiding. <laughs> the work would be, this was K to K, Kanyakumari to Kashmir. The next one would be, the long walk would be from Madanapalli to Mizoram in the northeast. Like, like Dr. Kalam said, if you go to the uh, east, uh, what is it called? Northeast. I will also come with you. Unfortunately, he is no more. And it's very interesting that he passed away in the Northeast. At least thinking about that, we should not give up this walk. I'm saying this because some people are still worried. Uh, apart from that, we are going to call all the coordinators together, have a brainstorming session and decide how in local areas Others can do the walk. If there is a small communal problem coming, go out and walk, I'm telling you. Anita is sitting there. She has been doing a lot of work in the rural area. She walks, she talks. This should spread as a movement in your own group. And any time you think there is a danger of the persons who are doing it getting murdered, I will come. I will come with you wherever you want me to come. And there are a few schemes which we want to work out. We will uh, try and work it out soon. I especially thank every one of you and every one of our coordinators. Special thanks to Dr. Venkatram, Venkatramana, who got an ambulance, medicines, driver, staff, everything for us from the BGS uh, Global Hospitals, right from Kanyagumari to Sri. And for all who helped us and who didn't walk with us, couldn't walk with us, but with your minds encouraged us on to this walk, I thank you all. Before I conclude, I want to tell you how this walk became a success and how I, at the age of 68, was able to walk. Let me do the 68 thing first. I might, you might say that I was born in 1949, so I'm 68 or 69, I don't know, I can't remember. Believe me, my mind is as young as the youngest of you here, not the little babies. And this is mainly because I bear no enmity towards anybody. And also because I practice yoga from the age of 10 and I have continued it till today, even today morning. Dr. Panda came to the hotel in Kathmandu to wake me up at 6. I was already up and finished my yoga. So I am again saying please practice yoga, control your diet. 
don't take things which are not good for you. I don't want to specify. What I mean is don't fill your tummy and make it like a barrel. That's what I mean. Hmm? And be kind to people. Kindness and having no enmity towards others actually increases your strength and energy. So we walked, all of us, this walk of hope. I think because we didn't say we did it. All of you did it. Everybody did it. Everyone who joined for the walk is responsible, not this person. Well, I might have ignited it. That's okay. Ignition comes through many sources, including Bosch. <laughs> so, I don't want to say anything more. Thank you very much. I didn't expect so many people will come and felicitate me. I just walked. Thank you very much. Namaskar. Shachri Akar.